Well, everybody's gearing up for the AFC Championship game this Sunday, but we got another thing to look forward to this weekend. Yes, indeed. We are joined by actress Diane Farr to hear more about the hit show Fire Country. Diane, good morning to you. And as we mentioned, uh, this episode comes on right after the AFC Championship game on Sunday. So I'm, I'm going to ask you, I know you're from Manhattan. Are you pro Eagles or pro Niners? I'm pro um, fire country. I don't even know what the AFC stands for. I don't know who's playing. I don't even care, but I know it's a really big, exciting deal. My castmates are freaking out. Are they really? Freaking I mean, out. It is quite a little lead in. It, it is. I mean, half America. There's be nothing there. little about that lead in. And they <laughs> flew in all the big guns for that episode. We have our like most pristine writer and our fanciest director, and the whole episode right, felt God. like a, a Bruckheimer movie. Oh, wow. It, Wow. Well, you guys are no, nothing to sneeze at. Eight million people tuning in to watch Fire Country. This show is huge. No, it's kind of crazy. Like, we don't have those numbers in network television since, yeah. like, Seinfeld. Yeah. I, it's like, I, it's super fun going through the airport these days. Like, I've, I've been on TV for so long, <laughs> your fame sort of goes up and down. But the airport is the best, is the best indication of... <laughs> How how it's going and yeah. it's going it's <laughs> going <laughs> we're getting a lot of going <gasps> <sister>. <gasps> that's a <gasps> yeah I get you I get you okay so the secret of the sauce of the show uh, is the action I mean I think people tune in for the action but the family story I think yeah. is the most fascinating part of this whole thing and I'm guessing as an actor it is for you as well. It is. That was the thing that drew me when I read the pilot. The pilot had the best turn I had ever seen, and I probably read a script every day for 30 years. So if I can't see what's coming, I was like, oh, yes, I want to do this. But our lead character, my son on the show, has to start every scene in an orange jumpsuit. Yeah. He's got to... He's got to begin with the worst thing he's ever done and win you back from there. And as his parents, we're the bosses, we're in charge, everybody respects us, and they let us fight as a couple, and wow. they let us disagree on the kid, and we never have the same take. Like, we're all a bunch of flawed human beings doing a super heroic job, but then you come back and you're just another piece of furniture in the house. Like, mm. we're all bumping into each other at a super humane level. Yeah. Yeah. Talk to us about um, the kind of the plot line of the show, because as you mentioned, so your son Bodhi is uh, he's an inmate firefighter and kind of the um, interactions that happen during crazy firefighting scenes and all kinds of things happen. Rescue yeah. included. The inmate firefighter program is a real thing in California. It's yeah. been around for years and it's an excellent way to like not only let people redeem on, on the outside and give something back to society but to be a part of a team and to be seen differently i mean anybody who's spent any time in a prison knows you don't really get there by accident most of the time it's people that don't have a lot of choices so now you have these firefighters working right alongside cal fire but they have no tools they have none of the instruments right. that the firefighters has they don't even have water so they have to sort of figure out how to use the land to protect itself. Like it, it's really, the whole story has got this really earthen quality. And as you know, Northern California can really show Ooh. off. Yes. The land is just gorgeous. Yes, indeed. Well, oh, man. I am loving the show. I cannot wait to so figure good. out what happens with your kidney problem. I, I'm telling yes. you, I'm all invested. I'm all invested. You and me too. And my children are like, mom, if they kill you, do we still get to go on vacation in the summer? <laughs> <laughs> the, the kidney questions Priority. make it all the way into my house. Yes. yes. <laughs> Listen, the, the kids have their priorities intact. Diane, an absolute pleasure speaking with you this morning. Thank, thank you so much for your time and enjoy the success that continues to be Fire Country. Uh, again, this episode coming up this Sunday after the AFC. It's going to take you longer to get through the airport, but it's worth it. It's worth it. <laughs> <laughs> so totally. Good. Thank you. Enjoy Bye. the game. Thank you, Diane.